I don't know whose idea it was. It might have been mine, but I'm, I don't know. It might have been Jess's. I don't know. But we figured let's do like a half hour's worth of music for each band member, which would be like six songs and like a cover, and make four CDs and a four CD package, and ship it out. I would I would be into that. It's cool because everybody in the band has their own influences and stuff. I think it would show all four sides of the band, you know? It's great because we'll get each of us to help each other with our own projects. So, you know, I might ask Darren to sing on one of my tracks or ask Jess to play drums or have Chad play some guitar on something. And, you know, I'll also play on Chad's stuff or Darren's stuff or Jess's stuff too, so. Like, Matty J can play every instrument really good, so. He doesn't need anybody's help, but I would need help from people. You know, Jess doesn't really write or sing or play guitar or anything, so I don't know what he's going to do with his record, but if he has to write his own songs, I'm sure he'll, you know, they'll be CKY-ish. If I'm doing a solo record, I probably don't feel like titling it CKY because it's not, so. I would probably just put it out on my own. I don't know why we have to put them all together. I don't know. I don't know what it would be like, but uh, I don't know, probably more rock. I mean, with some like old school Parliament funkadelic type stuff, maybe thrown in. I don't know. I have no idea. That's that's the beauty of it. I don't I don't know what the hell is going to happen. I, I don't want to put too much thought in it into it. You know, I just want it to happen. What's the point in doing solo records? You just did them. But he said, no, man. Darren's like, no, I'm going to write CKY style shit. And I wouldn't. They came with that idea. And, you know, Chad was a little bit, you know, fighting him on it. And I can see both of their uh, sides of the story. And that's what I do good usually is I kind of look at both sides of the, of the story. I never agreed to do it. I want to do a CKY record. That was, that's what makes sense to me. Four separate records would be great to do, but I don't know what that has to do with CKY. I mean. I'm not really interested in going into the studio and, and writing new songs or recording new songs. Just, there's, no, there's no reason for it. There's no uh, demand for that. It's way too much work to make a CKY album. It takes way too long. It's a huge undertaking. and. The way things are these days is like, it's not worth it, <laughs> you know? You wouldn't build a fucking Rolls Royce and then have it stolen as soon as you got done building it, you know what I mean? Like, maybe if you're building Hyundais or whatever, then you don't care as much, but if you work your ass off handcrafting a car that takes a really long time to build and it's a pain in the ass, and then as soon as you park it on the lot, it just gets stolen every time. You'd stop making cars. To me, a good excuse for Jess and Darren to not have to travel out of each other's prospective coasts, where Darren can stay in LA and Jess can stay in PA and not go through the hassle of working with me to get an album done. It's a solo record. Like, if we're gonna do that, let's just goddamn get together. I wanna make a record where we go into a room and play together and work on shit and do it really quick and write together in a room forcefully no matter how awkward it may be or what we used to or how we used to write. I would like to develop the band into a real band that plays in a room together and comes up with songs because then all the songs will translate a fuckload better live. So if we wrote live, it's always going to feel right, you know, we wouldn't play it if it felt awkward, so. No, I, I, I don't think... I don't think that if we did that, we would come up with good stuff. And I don't think it would be bad because we all know what sounds bad. So why would we settle on shit? And everyone's afraid to write like that because they think it might suck. But why would it suck if it's us doing it? It doesn't make any sense to me. <laughs> we won't make it suck. How's that? <laughs> don't make it suck. I also see Chad's end of it, because Chad kind of wants us to go into a room and all just jam and try to make some songs, which inevitably is what we should do. 
and that's I think that's what, that's what we should be doing. But I think this is actually a good stepping stone to get to that point because we're all going to be collaborating with each other, which is awesome, and it'll just bring us one step closer to that. Like, uh, not to be a negative or you know, put anybody down, but the four of us in a room, I just yeah. don't think would be productive. I think together we'll be able to get something done a lot quicker and reinvent the band to where we can make a whole lot more music by reinventing how we write together. What I don't like about putting out a single 10 song CKY CD is that I pretty much have to come up with the skeleton of 10 songs and the lyrics for 10 songs and work on them all at the same time. I mean, go get Volume 1, go get IDR, you know, those are like the pinnacle of CKY. Go get Carver City, that's like CKY on steroids. I mean, we, we did that. Like a lot of people listen to Carver City and it takes them 5,000 times to, to get it. You shouldn't have to do that necessarily. And just doing what we did, the method of any other record we did, we should never do again and none of us want to. It would just be take way too long and take way too much money to, to make a record and then when it comes out everyone just steals it anyway. So that's the reason that this solo record thing is kind of, is because we've destroyed ourselves making other, every other record to where it's a miserable experience. I, I think we should all go make some fucking different shit, you know? We're at that point in our career where we should go off and experiment. I would like to write something that sounds studio quality version of what we would write. I'd like to do it quick and I'd like to limit the clutter so people who don't have ears like us can hear the music and understand it. I mean, we don't know how to do it fast, I don't think. We've never done fast work. I mean, even with volume one, you know, <laughs> it took forever. There's been one riff that came about from jamming out of the band. The middle of flushing the gear. But when we get together as a band to write something, just, what do we start? What do we do? I think the band needs to deal with each other uh, a lot closer and put up with each other for a fucking couple weeks and stick each other in a room and make a good record playing together. That's what I want to do. So I'm going to hold down on doing any solo records until these guys uh, basically try to get into a room at least.